right, so this is my uh, first time using a cot. Um, I purchased this from uh, Mountain Hiker. As compared to like Nature Hike and uh, One Tiger Scots. So what I do know about it is, uh, it says in the description, 900 denier um, polyester. So we're going to test that out. It says it holds up to uh, 200 to I think 300 pounds. Very nice material. I don't know about 900 denier, but we'll see. So the aluminum poles are uh, 775 aluminum. So if you buy Nature Hike uh, cots, um, this is the ultralight from uh, Mountain Hiker. Uh, this is compared to the ultralight Nature Hike. Same, same material, same aluminum. Same construction, same design actually, just has mountain hiker on it, but it's cheaper, way cheaper. I paid 1900 baht, uh, which is around almost $60. Uh, the nature hike is uh, 3037 so it was a hundred and it would have been $120. I'm gonna hurry up before I lose daylight. So on these, uh, putting the legs together, the support, uh, they actually have uh, a fitted design, so it's really cool. So that's good. From what I see about this uh, cod, it's very well constructed and uh, exceeds my expectations of what I bought. So, really good. Now, this is cool about this cot though, you can actually lay it on the ground with the legs. It has uh, feet on the bottom, but also you can have the extensions put on. So, but that's what I'm gonna do is use the extensions. So one thing I read, or I didn't read, or I didn't see, it does have a pouch for your phone or whatever you wanna put in there. So that's really cool. Sunlight's going. Okay. Two. And three. So right then and there. Is done. Very lightweight. Very taut. All right, and just like that, very good. Very lightweight. Very feel this. Very good. I don't know about 900 denier, but very good. <laughs> yeah, she can pick it up. All right, so here's what it looks on the inside. It fits just to a T. <laughs> so there it is. And if she'll hold the camera, I'll get in there and lay on it. Just hold it still. Okay. I'm 5'9", and this is probably good for a six foot person at least, but this is perfect. But every time you get up, though, turn right. over. It's fine. It's lightweight. I've been having, since I've gotten older, I have a lot of trouble sleeping on the ground, uh, especially directly on the ground with just a sleeping bag. Um, 
padding is not enough for me to sleep on the ground. So uh, I'm going to try the cot out, man. Uh, this is, I think this is the way to go. So, yeah. You guys have any comments or questions, uh, link them down below and I'll be sure to uh, answer those. So, yeah, let me know what you think about the cot. All right. Babe? Bye bye. <laughs> Oh, you guys, check this out. Check this out real quick. <laughs> 300L. Zach set up I had. Okay, I got some peace and quiet. Finally, they uh, stopped weed eating. Uh, I want to tell you a little bit more about this uh, cot. I've been sleeping on it. This is my going to be my third night sleeping on it. Um, I can't say enough good things about it. Uh, I have shoulder problems sleeping on my side, um, my hips, when I lay on the ground. So I decided to get a cot and get off the ground. But I wanted something that was uh, lightweight, easy to carry, easy to break down, and easier or to fit in my tent. So I went with a mountain hiker. Um, I'll leave the link in the uh, description below. Let me give you the dimensions of this cot. It's 193 centimeters long. I'm 5'9", so that's a little bit somewhere over like at least six foot at least you can be on this. Um, and I can lay down and show you. So I'm 5'9". My head's right here. So I've still got room at the bottom. So another six inches at the bottom, five inches at least. Uh, this product claims it has 900 uh, denier Oxford cloth on it um, for added strength. I've seen anywhere from 300 to 600, but not 900. So that's that's really good. The weight capacity for this is 180 kilograms. I don't know what that is in weight. I think it's almost at least 300 pounds at least. Um, so the dimensions are 193 inches, or excuse me, centimeters long. It is three kilograms in weight, so very, very lightweight. 65 centimeters wide, so a little, little over, uh, little over two feet wide. And for the height, height dimensions, with the legs is 39 centimeters. From from here to here is 39. Without the legs, it's 15. Uh, the reason being I went with this version is because the fact that there's a lot of cots out there, they're ultra light, break down, but the thing is they don't come on the legs. They're only on the ground high. Uh, so this is an added bonus when you can get the legs the extensions on it uh, to, to get it off the ground even more. Uh, do either or. Very, very um, high strength. So let me show you. You got the extenders right here, feet, and also you got the feet in the middle of these. So this is 7075 aluminum. So high quality aluminum uh, in this product. Simple and easy to uh, put together. These all come out very easily. Put back in. I like the fact that. Uh, this has a pocket, which I haven't seen on too many, but this has a pocket for your lights or your camera. I got my headlamp in there. The only thing I would suggest if you're using this on cold nights is, is putting a, some type, type of pad down over this on the top, just to keep the cold air from coming underneath. Uh, that's the only thing I would really say about it. Uh, another thing too, when you, don't have the legs underneath and you're using just the, the, the foot foot pads if you decide to get out of the uh, get out of the, the cot and lean over this thing will tumble it will tumble uh, in the tent so just be careful of that um, it's a little bit unbalanced when it plus two I was uh, sitting on a little hill <laughs> so it didn't help Come here, girl. What are you doing? You hot? Come here. Hmm? What are you doing? Hmm? Want some water? Okay. 
I'm, I'm doing a video. You want to say hi to everybody? So these are the dogs that are in Thailand. Um, anybody that comes to Thailand, uh, these dogs are probably somebody's pet, but um, uh, this is a girl, I think. Yes, it's a girl. <laughs> but these are the typical dogs here in Thailand. They run, they run loose and rampant. If you go camping anywhere in Thailand, this is what you're going to experience. You're going to experience a lot of dogs just roaming around. Um, it, it is a little bit of a nuisance, but some of them are aggressive. Now, this one right here is not bad at all, uh, but I've seen her be a little bit dominant when it comes to uh, food uh, over the other dogs in the area. But yeah, I, I wouldn't walk up to any dog in Thailand and just start petting them because they'll snap your hand off. But this one's, she seems pretty young looking at her teeth. And her, She's got very clean teeth. She looks pretty young. Maybe, maybe two years, three years old. So, but that's all I have to say about the product. I'll link all the description in below. Um, and uh, yeah, you guys let me know what you think. All right, say bye. Say bye. on the ground too. So I recommend buying buying this product. It's very lightweight. Alright, so this is the Ultra Light Cot from Mountain Hiker.